In India, there are alternative investments portfolio. First, shares. A share is a small part of capital raised by the companies. There are two types. Equity shares, preference shares. As per Companies Act 1956, share capital of a company is divided into equal parts and each part is called share. A public limited company has to complete three stages. Registration, raising of capital, commencement of business. Public limited company issues shares to public for raising capital. For public issue is called initial public offer IPO. Share issued at par premium discount. A prospectus is prepared and get approved by CB Securities and Exchange Board of India. These shares, they are listed in stock exchange. The company make an application to stock exchange for listing of shares. Now, shareholders can sell shares in market. Shares are also called stock issued now on demand form. Means shares are credited to a separate account of an applicant opened with depository participant paperless security under DMAT. Now, shares are listed on stock exchange and which facilitate buying and selling of stocks in secondary markets. In Mumbai, uh, BSC and NSC. The purpose is to trading of securities between buyers and sellers, investing equity demand more, ta more time than other investments. Primary markets apply for shares offered to public. Secondary markets buying shares that are listed on stock exchange. Second type is debentures and bonds. Company issues for raising of finance capital, a method of uh, a method called debentures. Debenture is a small part of debt and it is certified under seal acknowledgement by a company to holder. It includes debenture stock, bond and any other security issued by the company. The company can raise loan from the public. A debenture holder is a creditor of a company, receives interest which is fixed. Bonds issued by government company and debentures are issued by private companies. Bonds may be tax saving but debentures are not tax saved. The companies owned capital, borrowed capital. Debenture holders have no say in company management. Interest is allowed and return on debenture it is at reasonable time and it is stable. The prices are much volatile because the prices are listed on the stock exchange traded in stock market. Debentures are redeemable over a period or maturity irredeemable. Convertible and non-convertible. Convertible to shares. It is popular uh, in last decade. India debentures were not popular till recently to raise capital. Now, bonds. Bearing interest on security, company borrow funds by issuing securities, bonds, save for one year uh, period, fixed maturity, uh, pay a fixed rate of interest. More or less one year, bonds, they are called commercial papers and treasury bills. Debt instrument, a contract is made between the two parties, uh, predetermined terms with regard to rate of interest, periodically of interest repayment uh, uh, on principle by the borrower to lender. In India, state and central governments, public sector organizations issue bonds, private corporations issue debentures. Now, public deposits. In 1990, they were very popular to raise funds as the bank credit because costly bank credit became costlier so companies for minimum three months up to 10 percent paid up capital accept public deposits 
and company cannot accept more than 35% of paid up capital and free resource. Middle class accept these deposits as company offers attractive interest rates reduced now to 10 to 12%. Company appoint collecting agents, managers to collect deposits. Next, bank deposits. Surplus money and investment in bank. It is popular among salaried people. Banks collect working capital requirements for business. Uh, customers deposit for a specific period and bank pays interest. The depositors can be accepted from individuals, institutions or enterprises. Business houses for profitability depend on the deposits collection. Now post office savings. Small savings from people through saving bank accounts. Facilities at income and securities uh, such as Kisan Vikas Patra, National Savings Certificates, they are sold through post office. And other savings like recurring deposits, monthly income schemes, public product fund, etc. Small investors use these type of savings facilities for investing their saving and surplus money for short term or long term benefits. Stable return, security, safety on investment and loan facility against deposits. Tax benefit is attraction of the investment. Return on investment is rather low. Interest rate is reduced recent years. Now public product fund. It is an attractive tax sheltered investment scheme for middle class and salaried persons even useful to businessmen and higher income earning people. Public product fund is very popular among marginal income taxpayers. The scheme introduced in 1969. Thank you.